Insert keyboard. Open up keyboard. We are ready to blast. Oh, that is. Five. Four. I think I'm going to move out the three, way. Two. One. Blast off. Oh, that was a bit of a letdown. I thought you were going to run really fast or something. Oh. <laughs> What's going on out here? <laughs> so, Paw Patrol are saving the house from the attack of the deadly mummy slipper. Paw Patrol are on a is that, what, is that what's happening, Bea? No, the Paw Patrol has slipped on the ice. Oh no! Oh honey, what a brilliant game. Uh, <laughs> at least the pups are out, but Ryder ride fell out. Oh yeah. no, they See need to rescue Ryder then. Come on, Dorothy. They seem very happy this morning. Um, we're back on to Monday, but it's the last Monday of school term so we've got three days and then you're on holiday aren't you yeah. oh goody <laughs> we've got lots of really good stuff planned though haven't we uh, but um, there isn't there's anything planned on every day no not yet but and you know what some days it's nice to just be able to hang out and play minecraft and isn't it watch watch videos just go for a walk. Some days it's good to have quiet time. Disney. Disney. Well, all right, yeah, I get it. Disney will be the best. I've got an away day planned. Paul does have the day off. He always takes a day off after Cub Camp, but it's because he's shattered. So I made the mistake of going, yeah, a couple of years ago, going, yay, yeah, Paul's got the day off. We can do something. No, bless him. He's exhausted. So he stays in bed and recovers, and then we get a nice evening together, which is fine. Um, but I am going out for the day with my mum and with Luke and we are going down to, to um, Gunworth Keys and uh, do a little bit of shopping, have some lunch and uh, just generally hang out, which would be really nice actually. Luke's good company. My mum's brilliant company, but you know that. Um, so yeah, that's what we're up to today. And apparently we're having a heat wave for the next few days. It's when it gets extremely hot for a few days, so we're going to need to put some sun cream in your book bags. Maybe put some on you before you go to school. Yeah? So that's what's happening today. I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be a good day. Well, because Luke took the kids to school for me, because he's not working today, I have... Wiggins! Wiggins! Please stop eating the sink, the, licking the knives and forks in the dishwasher. It's not safe. But it's meant that I've been able to start a few projects and just carry on with them rather than stopping midway to take the kids to school, which is fantastic. So I have put a Caribbean tea bread into uh, Gerard, who is a bread maker. And I've made some cereal bars. And these are the sorts of things that I stopped doing when I joined Slimming World. It's a really difficult balance to strike because when you are sticking to a um, regimented food plan, if you love to cook, you're losing, you lose some of that spontaneity and the, mm, I've got some of that left over, I'm gonna make some of those. So I'm trying to find the balance. Um, even if I don't lose ever, lose any more weight, but stay like this and just find a much more natural balance in, in what I do with my day and my time, I would be very pleased with that. Uh, keep my hobbies going, keep the, the joy and the oomph that I find from being in the kitchen, but not inhale bags and bags of Cadbury's giant buttons. <laughs> Just allow me a little moment to daydream about that. <sighs> okay, back in the room. So. I feel great. I've got to go and tidy the bit kids' bedrooms quickly before we go out. And uh, then we're going to go off shopping. Woohoo! Well, I have just discovered the most amazing taps I think I've ever seen. They've kind of got these um, air wing things on them. 
just superb. Really so you stand there and you wash your hands and then the, the air bits come out and then they dry your hands at the same time. It's brilliant. Anyway, here we are. Looking glorious. Not me, obviously. The weather in the area. Absolutely beautiful. I you I've put together a list on ASOS of summery, holiday-y, floridery stuff. And I know, and I, can I send it to you or would that be really... Um, presumptuous and presumptuous slightly arrogant? And slightly arrogant, yeah. <laughs> Are those the words you were looking for? I was for? looking for presumptuous, yeah. Um, it's not expensive stuff. It's okay. Like, the issue is, if you buy loads of stuff before we go... Yeah. I'm going to want to buy, I'm not going to want to buy something there. So what would you rather do? Go with loads of stuff and then not be allowed to buy anything? Or go with the bare minimum and be allowed to shop? I don't know. You want to do both? Yeah. That's not happening. Mm. I really want to buy this stuff though, it's gorgeous. Um, it was nearly finished and Dorothy just skipped to the end or when I said please can I watch it okay well so it's not that you want to turn it over it's that she skipped to the end and you wanted to see what was already on yeah okay all right I'll come and have a word with her about that did you catch anybody what mm, what did you catch uh, you caught something with a really cool nose? Yeah. But you don't know what it's called? No. No? They don't have the names like in the normal game. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I think we need to try and actually get it to fit, honey. <clears throat> yeah, to my I should try and wear them because then they'll get looser and bigger. Well, yes, but that will only work if we can actually get it on in the first place without me breaking any of your bones. Oh! Yeah. Mum? Yeah? Push. Push, 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 push. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Why do people buy vans if they're this difficult to get on? Fashion, it always, that always happens. Push. I won't break my finger at the same time. <sighs> the guy in the shop said that they're supposed to be hard to get on and they would just get easier and easier, but I mean, this is madness. You'd just never wear them, would you? We've done it. Look. We've done it. Ta da! We did it. They are so cute. <laughs> How comfy are they? Yeah. Can we take this off? Well, no. Your toes are right at the end, actually. Dorothy, don't pull it off, please. But I want it off. No, I don't think we're going to keep them, love. We're going to take them back. Oh. I know. But you're going to grow out of them so quickly. You get them size up? in the shade of your birthday. Yeah. What does that mean? On! Ta-da! But mine are on fair and square. Yes, but do you know what? If there was more growing room in the end, I'd say we'll keep them and stretch them. But there is hardly any growing room. Your toes are right there. So we're going to take them back. Oh, which means another trip to Gunworth Keys. Mm -hmm. And we'll try and get a bigger size. Okay? You sad? Hmm. That's not real crying. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> right, say goodbye. Dorothy, say goodbye. Bye.